Hello guys and welcome to Project Cat Paper Lily Prologue. Alright, so this is a free demo on Steam. And as the game title suggests, it's a prologue to a upcoming game named Paper Lily. So since I do have an indie RPG series line I, i'm not sure if i've talked about yet but yeah i'm i'm gonna consider each each series like a kind of line like a kind of series where they're all the same theme anyway but yeah um basically i'm gonna keep around the indie rpg uh series line and this is gonna be one of them i actually want to play paper lily when it comes out so let's start with the prologue, as is pro probably and most possibly intended. There's a white flower on the ground. Press A to pick up items. Yes. Press the lines to open your menu. Okay. Inventory? Yep. Okay. Uh, straightforward enough. There is no save. There is, there is only settings. The building ahead seems locked somehow. To use an item, stand close and select the item from the menu. Okay, so you need to... Straight up select the item from the menu. A tree with pink flowers. A tree with pink flowers. Some large windows. You see, the thing with these kinds of games... Just because the answer is obvious doesn't mean the answer is obvious, you know? <laughs> if I don't find anything, well... What can we do with the flowers? Third four colored lights, it's locked. Oh, what? I, I was just mashing. But apparently I can take out the flower. Fine, let's... The green light turned red. Is this a secret? Alright, let's take all the flowers out. I mean, it's a bit obvious to put the white flower in the fourth one. And turn them all green, but... I don't think... It's that kind of game. Oops. Oops. Yeah, see, it's so hard. It's so hard to get them all red because it then confirms if you want to put it back in. Is that open now? A door with four color lights. The door opened! There is always another way. Achievement unlocked. Fascinating. You've done the opposite of what I expected. A delightful surprise. How did you know? I wonder. I just mashed on the white flower until it gave me the option, man. Perhaps you're different. No, I'm a let's player that just has to try every option in these kinds of games. Or perhaps you cheated. Hmm. Nah. <laughs> How odd. Regardless, I advise you not to mess with things that don't belong to you. It's not safe for you. As you already know in this place. Things are not always what they seem. The answers you're looking for are not yours to take. You're not ready to learn the truth. And the truth is not willing to be learned by you. Okay, I can understand the first half, but the truth not willing to be learned by me is just mean, okay? What did I ever do to the truth? Why does the truth hate me? I can't stop you from coming. Eh. Just know that if you do, you will be killed. Such as is the way such is the way of our world. Mm-hmm. Whoa, weird dream. Everyone must be gone already. Looks like it's 11. I should get to it. Did no one wake you up? 
It's like, oh, cat's asleep. Ah, oh, whatever. Leave her there. Fine. Oh, no! You moved it! I didn't, I swear! You know I hate this type of thing. Th that can't possibly be happening. It's spelled die! My. Oh, no! Stop joking around, this is serious! Uh, we should not have played this. I told you, we're going to be cursed! That's pretty cursed. Here's Johnny. I mean, what was that? Is that a ghost? We summoned a ghost. A ghost wouldn't knock on the door. Oh my god, oh my... You're making too much noise. Oh, it's just cat. What's with the crazy knocking? What was that for? Did that spook you? You're not supposed to be here, you know. I could say the same about you. Why are you here? Actually, say hello to the new member of the occult club. I had the wonderful opportunity to meet all the members yesterday. I don't recall seeing you there. You three aren't part of the club, are you? That's funny. I didn't pin you of all people as the occult type cat. That's cause I'm not. Hey, we were doing something here. I'll save you the trouble. All three of you moved it. Huh? The planchette from your game. You all moved it. There's no ghost in the room. There's a simple scientific explanation. It's called the ideomotor effect. Simply put, just like your body reacts to pain reflexively, it may also react to ideas and move on its own. It's pretty mu it pretty much bypasses the part of the brain which we use for conscious behavior. So they were all thinking die at the same time. It's not all that different from blinking or breathing. The effect is even stronger when a bunch of gullible people who are desperate to believe in ghost stories get together and play. There was an experiment where the g players were blindfolded and suddenly the ghosts could no longer spell messages. You can try it if you don't believe me. In other words, your mysterious answers from beyond are really just your imagination playing tricks on you. Wow, what a wet blanket. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> great job killing the mood. You must be fun at parties. Thanks a lot, cat. Always a pre pleasure. All right, time to search. I should go over my notes to make sure I don't forget anything. Ooh, I love this song. It's bopping. There's some chalk here, take chalk. I don't know why I'm taking chalk, but okay. Sure, let's draw something in a blackboard. <laughs> let's draw a butt. My masterpiece, it's done. Wow. Sparkly. That was the most pointless thing you've done today. <laughs> okay, this game is personality. I love it. There's a book entitled Creepy Cryptids and Where to Find Them. Truth Behind Mermaids Exposed. They have feet. There's a book entitled Magic Circles for Simpletons. Suspicious news articles and poster representing magic circles. The window is open. A cool breeze op blows in from the inside. I mean, outside, close the window. Yes? <laughs> I don't know, man. A crystal ball is resting on a cushion. Wow, that cheap plastic exterior really makes it look authentic. Some books in jars filled with something. Expensive looking radio. Turn it on. What are you even doing? Just looking around. Cardboard boxes marked with a symbol. They're sealed with tape. The runes my f my friend mentioned may be in here, but I need to find a way to open it. Okay, we need to open that box. Spherical model of the earth red crosses mark certain locations. <gasps> you can spin it! Spin it! Spin it! Spin it! Oh wait, I got an achievement for that. <laughs> a thick purple book. A spell book looks weird, and it also looks fake. 
Trash can, it seems to be full. Yes, I watch Manly Badass Hero. I, I'm not stealing his joke. <laughs> A stuffed crow. An interesting choice of decoration. Crows can save your game. Okay, okay, okay. Slot one, two, and three. Wow. Guess there's only three endings. <laughs> Box for the game. Ouija board for two to four players. Get answers from beyond. Warning, we take no responsibility for any adverse effects playing this game could cause to you or your loved ones. Such as disappointment, I assume. Can I open the window? Oh, let's not open the window. Uh, I guess we talk to them now. What are you looking at? I bet you think you're so funny. We have other plans for the night anyway. Whatever you say. She's really concentrated on fixing her ribbon. Best not disturb her. So what are you doing here? Visiting the school at night is hardly normal, no matter what you're looking for. I could ask you the same question. You already know what we were doing. Keyword were. Truth is, I'm doing the same thing as you girls, but it's spookier than your game. A game? Can we join in? I thought you had plans for the night. Eh. We can probably spare an hour or two. It's 11 in the evening. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do at this time of night? In any case, it's a one-person ritual, so you can't join me on it. Figures. I need three rooms, 12 candles, a lighter, a rune, a tuft of hair, chalk. I'll, I'll read the preparations later. Oh, I needed to read that first. All right, so I need to search the school for the items first. Uh, the rune is probably inside. The rune is probably inside this. Yeah. Do I need... Can I go out? Oh, yeah, I can go out. No running in the hallways. <laughs> While moving! Hold X to run. Oh, okay. Windows of the classroom, you can't see through much. Let's not run in the hallways, just in case, you know? Alright, let's see. According to my notes, I need to move the desk to the sides in all three classrooms. Then I can draw a path in the middle of each one with chalk. We'll, well, I'll leave the chalk drawing for last. I want to gather everything I need first. Should I? Not yet. Okay, let's not let's not do the desk first. Not gonna lie, this place is pretty spooky. Not that anything's happening right now, but it's still pretty spooky. I want to run, but I don't want to run because the sign said don't run. Anything down here? It's locked. <laughs> Give up and go home. Yes, this is scary. That night, I got cold feet, I guess. I went home without completing the ritual. And despite that, I made plans to try again. However, both my notes and the letter had disappeared without a trace. I tried telling myself that maybe the ritual was a scam anyways. But now, how will I ever know? Dead End 2. K2. Cold Cat Feet. Oh, you, you can talk to her again. If you like this kind of occult stuff, why aren't you in the club? Only nerds join this club. That's not entirely false. You didn't bring any other games? Not even a deck of cards? Not really. We didn't anticipate someone ruining our game. Fair enough. So how did you get in here? I have so many questions. <laughs> We got a key from someone. I got a key from someone. She got a key from someone. Couldn't you just have joined the club? Why? Is that what you did? Join the club just for the key? This conversation isn't going as planned. What were you looking for earlier? Materials for the ritual. Shouldn't you have gathered them ahead of time? Yeah, cat. Shouldn't you have gathered them ahead of time? Now that's boring. Do you also do your homework ahead of time? Hmm. She got us there, boys. She got us there. 
I, I don't know what to say to that. We will probably go home soon. We will probably go. <laughs> All right, so I'm, let's just sort the desks now. Push the desk into the green zone to complete the puzzle. Where are the? Oh, <laughs> crap. Okay, okay, okay. Whoops. And that's done. That was easy. Since we're, well, si we're doing this for three rooms, right? And we we just draw the chalk later. So let, let let's just sort it for now. Well, come on, man. Why would anyone even arrange their desks like this? Like seriously. Phew. Right. We're done with the desks. What else? Sort the desks in each classroom, turn off all the lights, and draw the curtains in each classroom. Draw a path along the three rooms with chalk. In the middle room, place one candle on each desk, light the candles, and wait for at least five minutes. After waiting, burn the tuft of hair on one of the candles, blow out all the candles, close your eyes and count to 100, open your eyes, and then... Alright. So we have to... Draw the ca the curtains in each room. I mean, the lights are already off, so. Uh oh, the curtains here are missing. According to the ritual instructions, I need to black out all the rooms. But where will I find new curtains? Something we can figure out in a bit. Let's just finish all the rooms for now. Is there anything in the trash can? The trash can. It kind of looks trashy. Oh, okay. I wonder if any of the girls is a member of this club? Yeah, okay, so... I needed to talk to the door because there may be cur curtains in the theater room, which kind of makes sense. Say, are any of you members of the theater club? Not really. Not really? Not me. Who wants to know? Well, there's a talent agent waiting outside. He's only interested in teenage girls with a passion for role-playing, though. <laughs> it's pretty specific there. What is it you want? I just need to borrow something from your club room. You have the key with you, right? Hmm... Fine, you can have it if you can do me a favor first. I'll do you a favor. I'll conveniently forget to tell the principal that you three broke into a school at night, deal? Aren't you trespassing too? So what's the favor you need? Get my notebook in classroom 3C under my desk. Should I get the notebook for her? Ah, sure. You will? Then when you find it, please don't look through it. Sure, sure. Uh, let's be a nice friend. There's a red notebook here. Obtain Ponytail's notebook. You don't even know her name! <laughs> Some friend you are. Well, then again, I guess we aren't really friends. We just met, like, right now. Just acquaintances, I guess. My seat is in the second row in the front. Class 3C. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't... I kind of just brute forced it. Here, have your notebook. It, is this your notebook? Yeah, that's it. I hope you didn't look through it. Nope, your secrets are safe. All right, here's the key. Bring it back when you're done with it. Thanks. School bag. Maybe you don't suck as much as I thought. Okay, well, we don't... She, I don't suck as much as they thought. That's... That's plus... Social point, I guess. I don't know, man. But I have the key now. All oh, right, need to go into the inventory. Door unlocked. Some blankets are sprawled on the floor. They are too heavy to use as curtains. Just use actual curtains. Obtain curtains. Chalkboard. There are stars drawn on it. Okay. Various makeup. 
Several handmade costumes. Bleh, they have poor taste in clothes. There's really no incentive to check out the contents of the trash can. Table with blank sheet and colored pencils. Really? There's no incentive? I'm gonna keep trying. No, there's no incentive. <laughs> All right, we got the blankets. That's for the second room, I guess. Oh no, this is a third room. Hope these curtains will work. That should do the trick. And they're actually red. Okay, perfect. Now we can technically draw the lanes right now. But we don't have a rune. We need a rune, right? Yeah, we need a rune, a lighter, and a tuft of hair. We have a lighter. Oh, we actually have the candles already. Uh, okay. That's it. We just need a rune and a tuft of hair. Oh, there, is, there are the scissors. Take the scissors, yep. So that should allow me to open this door. I mean this thing. I need a way to open this. I'm not going to carry the entire box around. Finally, let's cut this open. There's a bunch of useful, useless trash in here. Aha! This box, this little box may be it. There's three runes, but the ritual didn't mention a specific one. Weird C, the weird B, the weird O. Let's take the weird O. Obtain protective rune. Switch my rune. What What do the other... Weird B. Switch my rune. Weird C. Okay, they're all protective runes. And you can just take everything. <laughs> let, let, let's, let's experiment with the take everything in the future, shall we? We need, we need to get the tuft of hair, right? <gasps> Obtain girl's hair. What the hell are you doing to her? She, she cut her hair. Why? Get out right this second. Well, at least I got what I wanted. She's angrily fidgeting with her ribbon. Don't talk to me anymore. I won't forget this. Forget. Huh? Is there a nice way to do that? Okay, so there must be a nice way to get the hair, right? Well, I need a tuft of hair for the ritual. Should I cut my own hair? Oh, there we go. You can just use it on yourself. Here I go, I suppose. Obtain my hair. I never want to do that again. Oh, well. Anyway, let, let's just do the ritual, shall we? I think we have everything, right? Sorry, chalk. Well, my lines aren't perfect, but it should do the job. I need to do this in all three rooms. I need to set up and light the candles on top of all the desks in... Yeah, like this. Okay, that's one side down. And this is the other side. Uh, yep. Oh, I only set up the candle. It's not lit. Damn it. Ba -ba. Everything's ready. All that's left is to wait five minutes and then burn the hair. It's going to be such a pain to clean up. Oh, no, I didn't read. I didn't read the lower half of this note. Seriously? Stop messing with things! But everything I mess with ends up being a scam! What if someday it isn't? What if you end up summoning some ghost or the devil and condemning your soul to the eternity in the netherworld? What if your soul is already damned? Well, then there's nothing to worry about. <laughs> then I guess that's what's waiting for me after I die. Cat! It was a joke! 
You're not gonna find him this way, you know? I'll just do whatever you want, no matter what I say, won't you? It's possible. Stubborn Baka. I prefer ambitious idiot. So, will you tell me where the letter is? You exhaust me, cat. you know that? And yet, here we are. I knew when, it's in the occult club. There's a golden envelope in one of the drawers, but they won't let you sniff around since you're not a member. Thanks, you're the best. Huh? Is there something at the door? Provision complete, let's burn the hair tuft on a candle to start the ritual. Alright. Burn the tuft of hair on one of the candles. Blow out all of the candles. Close your eyes and count to 100. Open your eyes and then... So you need to count to 100. Alright. Let's do this. We don't need to blow the candles off when they do when they do it themselves. That's that's spooky. I guess I should count to one hundred. Twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. Why am I doing this? This ridiculous game couldn't possibly work. Five fifty-six, seven fifty-eight. I wonder if mom is worried about me. Huh? What was that? 79, 80, 81. What's all that noise? I think someone entered the room. I is anyone there? One hundred. So I open my eyes? Now you've done it. Worked? It worked? It worked! I can't believe it! I don't think that's a good thing. This is incredible! But where am I? It's a hallway. It definitely isn't the school. This is unbelievable! How could it have it worked? It doesn't make any logical sense. I was in a classroom a minute ago. Have I gone mad? This is so exciting! I can't believe it worked! If I woke up from this and it turns out to be a dream, well, that would be disappointing to say the least. Okay, I definitely need to check this place out. Ah, uh, sure. Ew. Black substance drips from above. Hold up while climbing, while moving to climb up the stairs. Okay. Door with an odd pattern. Door with an odd pattern. Hey, that door's open. It's locked. Oh, no, no. Okay. The door with a glossy finish. You can see yourself in it. It's locked. Mirrors? But staring to mirrors in a place like this. It's almost like I'm asking to get jump scared. Yep, let's not do that. <laughs> Wait, I, I want to go up these. A fairly normal looking door. It's locked. Come on, man. That's strange. Have I already passed through here? Yep, you have. I have. Hmm. There must be something I missed. I mean, aside from all the doors that are locked, I'm not sure what else you missed. The door has no keyhole. I can see one right there. It's a square. I don't know, man. Wait. We're not running into doors anymore. Ooh, that's not good. Huh, am I lost? 
I don't remember this hallway being so long before. Run back. Huh? There's a key hanging from the hook. Take the key. I have no choice. Fairly looking key for the fairly looking, no fairly normal looking door. The key fits. Before, f I mean, sure, why not? But you know, it, it it really doesn't matter at this point. Not like I made many decisions for it, you know. Huh? What's this? Am I back at the school already? A paper slip with some rules and regulations. No running in the hallways. No screaming during recess. No escaping forever. Classroom 4A. Classroom 56W. Let's have some fun, shall we? Entertain me for a while and in return you get... Nothing. Huh? Who's talking? Can I run in the hallways? I stare you down! And he's gone. <laughs> Damn it! And do you even know where you are? You chose a one-way trip to hell, kid. Where are you? Well, if you're not gonna help, then be quiet. I'll leave once I find what I came for. Pretty brave of you, cat. What are what are these? Unsealed golden letters scattered across the floor. They seem to be rituals with various titles. The mirror ritual. The ritual of the well. The bus ritual. The three room ritual. This is the one I did. These all come in golden letters. Do they all work? I should look into this when I get home. I don't think you're getting home, kid. You think you can leave? Now that you can prove that these rituals work, you have no way of going back to tell anyone. The knowledge will die with you. That's... That's a lie, right? You're just trying to scare me. Door is stuck and won't open. I didn't... I, I wasn't aware that there was a random-ass door in the middle of the hallway, but okay. Oh, let's run. Let's save, our, let's just save ourselves some time. Are you lost? Oh, let me guess. Oh, yeah. Here we go. You should give up. You'll never leave this place. figures stare at you from the other side of the windows. That's pretty freaky, not gonna lie. Your mother will be devastated to learn that she's now completely alone. No husband, no daughter, everyone left her. How pitiful. How dare you say something like that? You know nothing about me. You couldn't tell your father goodbye back then, and now you won't tell you won't get to tell your mother goodbye either. What if I told you that someone you know is in here with you? Would that make you feel hopeful? Relieved? I know you're thinking you, is, you can escape with him, but these rituals have no way back. They were never designed that way. After all, why would you give your prey an escape? Oh ho ho ho! Cat, I know more about you than you think. Let me show you something. Huh? Th this is... Oh, we can move. Any of a vague memory. Trash can filled with blank piece of paper. Science books. Ho ho ho! What the hell? A pile of science books. Bookmark. Physiology. There's also a notebook filled with rough scribbles and notes. Bookshelf has always felt too large for comfort. Pile of books. Hands in the window. Just what is this place? Close that. <laughs> Bookshelf towers over your small finger, and if I spam this, it's gonna fall on me, right? Right? That's how these games work, right? Okay. 
<laughs> Out of anatomy books. For a book and a photo of someone. Can we see the photo of someone? Can we use anything here? Though. So, I should have taken all the runes, honestly. <laughs> I think we're gonna need them. So, what did you think? I can see everything that's inside your head. You really should make an effort to be more lively. You only have until I decide I'm done playing around with you, you know? And then, snap. There's something about... <laughs> okay, there's something about plain ass corridors that are you know they're they're unnerving because there there's never a corridor with no purpose in real life so when there's a corridor that just there's not there's nothing here other than solid wall so when there's a corridor with absolutely nothing like it's claustrophobic i guess how oh, would you like to say he's trapped in here until you die Um, oh no, am I actually trapped in here? Did I do something wrong? Is this how it's supposed to be? Maybe now you will reflect on the stupidity of your actions. In the meantime, I'll just watch you run away. Sh shut up, that's enough. Whoever you are, get out of my head! My life is my business. My decisions are mine alone. Let me out of this place. I know there's a way out. There has to be. Please. I want to go home. That's more like it. So he just wants to see us suffer, basically. I'm back in this hallway. I don't like this. I need to get out of here. Text is updated. Escape this cursed place. I mean, I can't believe you thought it was fun in the first place, but okay. Are any of the... Oh, this door is open now. This door is open. Wasn't it boarded up? Everything else is locked. I have no other choice but to go in. Blood. Oh, that's not good. A beheaded corpse. That can't be. How is this possible? I just saw her a while ago. I don't understand. Yeah, we, we specifically told him not to come with us, a bloody corpse. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, my God. This can't be real. It's not real, right? A bloody corpse. The lower half is missing. Hey, this is my fault. Exit. A welcoming door. It's locked. I have to get out. E. Fortunately, the door has no keyhole. Scissors. Protective charm. That's not gonna help. Really? Chop. Oh. The door. It's, it's just gonna be a bait, isn't it? We're not actually getting out. I can leave? I can go home? I don't think you're going home, Miss Cat. Yep. Goodbye. I don't want to die. Why not? Everyone should try it at least once. Snap. The end. I think that was the true end. Yeah, according to Steam, that was the true end. All right, so I'll just screw around with the other possibilities. I feel like there's other things 
Everyone who made a video or stream, yep. You're welcome, Project Cat. True and K1, Curiosity killed the cat. Alright, so... I'm pretty sure there's other stuff, you know. Note from the devs, we really appreciate you taking the time to play our little game. It means the world to us. What you have played is the prologue to Paper Lily, a larger project we are currently working on. We got amazing feedback for Project Cat so far, and hope you look forward to Chapter 1 coming soon. If you like what you played, it would help us a lot if you leave a review. Thank you so much! Oh. I c oh, you can't... You can't start Chapter 1. <laughs> but it's there. Like, this is the game. They're just gonna add something to it when Chapter 1 comes out. Okay, 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 I see. Alright, as I said... Gonna... Gonna see if I find anything else that's special. I mean, something that's extra, I guess. Alright, let's try putting the white rose as... Huh? It's not in my inventory. What? Oh, I don't think I picked it up. Oops! <laughs> but yeah, let's try um, putting the white flower as expected in the vase. Flower sank into the water. Uh Pity? You thought that would work. You should be more careful about the decisions you make. The solution may seem obvious, but... There is always another way. You may not notice it right away, but your actions will have an impact sooner or later. You may not even remember what you did to cause it. Sadly, regret is always in the shadow of choice. Also, you know very well this isn't your home. So why do you mess with things that don't belong to you? You're not welcome here. Look. The result of your actions. The result of your expectations. Things are not always what they seem. What do you think? Does this still look like a flower to you? You're not prepared to deal with the truth, are you? I can't stop you from coming here, but if you're foolish enough to cross my path... I'll kill you myself. Such is the way of our world. Oh, okay. It, it, it's just a different intro. Alright. Okay, so there's a dusty hairpin in this one. Oh, that's probably to get... To help the girl with the ribbon. So that she has a hairpin for it. Ah, I see, I see. Okay, first let's try reading the diary. Looks like a private journal. Look through it, yes. Let's see. Blech. Just math problems and girly doodles all over. This isn't worth my time. Okay, so there was nothing in her um, diary. Alright. There was a ton of useless objects in the boxes and a letter. Read it. Roses are red, violets are probably violet. My love for you sparkles like the glow of a diamond. I watch you every day, I watch you every night. I watch you. I watch you, I wa Okay, that just became Yandere at the end. That doesn't sound right. So yeah, I just use the scissors on these things. Anything in here? Oh, can I open these? There's no point in brandishing your scissors at the already open. Okay. So that was an achievement, but I don't... Not Can I... Is that in my inventory? Not really. Anyway, so... I think there's really a bunch of things that I'm missing here. Like, I can give this key back. Are you done with it? Yeah, thanks. I'm surprised you even gave it back. Maybe I misjudged you. Oh, there we go! Will you at least tell us more about your game? I'll let you know how it went on Monday. If it's anything like the rest I tried, it won't really do anything. What's with all the chit-chat? Are we suddenly friends or something? 
She's alright, I guess. <laughs> but she ruined our night. Sorry about that. Well, alright, fine. She means apology accepted. Nice to meet you then. I'm Kat. We know! I'm Julie. This is Saki, and this is Kaya. Nice to meet you. Can we? Oh, we can sit down now. What are you doing? I thought you were busy. I'm just taking a break. Is that so? Are you scared? You're scared, aren't you? Did you come to us for comfort? The only thing scary... <laughs> the only scary thing here is that attitude of yours. She's still upset about... At you messing up our night, as you can see. It's okay to be scared. Oh, I know. Why don't you show us your ritual as an apology? I'm kind of interested too. Well, the rules say... Oh, come on. You don't actually think it's gonna work, do you? It's just a game, as you said. The rules don't actually matter. I suppose not. Well, then it's decided. We'll tag along with you. You're tasked with entertaining us now. <laughs> well, I suppose it can't be helped. Let's go then. Huh? Oh, <gasps> we... Oh, actual party. Wee! <laughs> All right. I'm gonna go save. Isn't this stuffed crow just so cool? What? Oh, no. <laughs> so, you're that type, huh? It, it, it was an accident. And what's it supposed to mean anyways? This isn't good. It's okay. You can just apologize next week. Yeah, it's okay. It was... Probably the only valuable thing in this room anyways. Ugh. All right. Let's close the window. Window's freaky. So, I'm guessing you can take with them... Take the... Oh my god. <laughs> I'm guessing you can take them on the ritual. But I, I want to try a couple of things. Like... Can we open this now? Oh wait, I, I haven't found my hair clip. Hang on. Let me go get the hair clip. It's right here. I want to see if you can open that door now. There we go. I want to see if you can open that door with a party because I'm pretty sure this party changes things, you know? Alright. The room is... What is this room anyways? I don't think I've ever seen anybody use it. Oh, there. We, we have dialogue now. Me neither. Say, why don't we check it out? You want to break into his room? Why not? Can't be any worse than trying a silly ritual. I suppose it's safe. We would need a way to open it, though. We're counting on you. You can do it, Cat. I, I never... Jeez, uh, fine. I already found the hair clip. It's so dark. Let's see what's behind this door. Maybe we'll find exam answers. Or dead bodies. Or maybe it's just a supply closet. There we go. Door unlocked. It's so dark. Come on, ponytail. Don't chicken out on me now. Don't call me that. You have a ponytail, don't you? I have a name too. Yes, she does. A large locker that could probably fit a person. It's locked. <gasps> Wait, I need... No, 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 no. Forget it. Forget it. Nah. Any sakers? What do you need? Just a bit of hair? Why don't you cut your own? I thought you girls wanted to participate. No, Kaya, you don't have to do that. It's alright, I'll give you mine. There's no need for that, I'll just cut some of mine. Are you sure? Yeah, it would be, it'd be, a, it would be a waste to use yours. I, I, I didn't mean to do that, but okay, I guess we got... Thanks! Ugh. Okay, well, they're participating, but that's not what I want to do right now. The hairpin doesn't fit into this lock, okay. Cleaning cart. Boxes. Can we... Can we open it? Box is already open. Okay. Sealed box. Box contains various empty notebooks, textbooks, and chalk. Take chalk? Sure. I already have enough chalk, but the more the merrier. What kind of ritual is this? 
Lots of cleaning, smells weird, dusty lamp, bulb missing. School supplies. Small key in one of the shelves. Take it, small key. Probably for a locker, huh? S this is the lost and found box. Really? Look, I found my old shoe. A shoe? I lost it years ago. How do you lose one shoe? It just disappeared. Oh, my lighter! Don't don't you already have a lighter? This is my old one. You lost a lighter in school? No, they confiscated it. Figures, lighters can be dangerous. Only in the wrong hands. And yours aren't. You shouldn't bring lighters to school. Alright, so I think we can use the key on this thing, probably. Wait, this is a locker, right? Oh, I just wasn't right up to it. The key fits! There's some dusty documents that catch your eye. Read them? It's a... Lawsuit? What's that doing in a place like this? I heard about that from my dad. Supposedly someone sued the school because of their daughter's disappearance. Oh, the second year girl? I heard something happened, but I didn't know the school was involved. I don't know either. But she was last seen at the school, so her family was convinced that something happened here, and it was covered up. There's definitely an odd history of disappearances in this town. When I am gradu when I graduate, I'm out of here. Is there anything else? Anything in the trash can? Why would there be a trash can in a supply closet as a spare? Okay. All right, last thing I want to try. What are you doing? Are we done already? Yeah, let's go. Really? I guess I'll go get my stuff. And so we went home without completing the ritual. For some reason, I lost interest after that. In exchange, I gained some new people to talk to. Well, I suppose the ritual couldn't have been that important anyways. Dead end K4, never mind forever. Let's try something new. I need to get this open. Um, ever heard of nails? Yeah, I, I saw this off camera, but basically with, with these guys in the party, um, everything just kind of works. <laughs> like a weird B, like everything so easy, you know? All right, we're tracing the last room with chalk. And if I recall correctly, this is when this room gets dark, right? Yeah, when the music stops. So does anything change in here? Crow still broken. Everything's still here. Nothing else of use. Oh! That this drawer was locked the last time, right? There's a golden envelope in the drawer. These are the instructions for the ritual I'm doing. Thankfully, I shortened them when I wrote my notes. Read the full ritual notes? Sure. You must play alone. Requirements. Three dark adjacent rooms, 12 candles, a lighter or matches. A rune, a tuft of human hair, white chalk or white paint. Preparations. Start after the sun has set. All three rooms must be pitch black. Turn off all the lights, draw the curtains, and close the doors. Using the chalk or paint, draw a path going through the three rooms. The path will serve to connect your location to your destination. In the middle room, place six candles on each side of the drawn path parallel to it. Instructions. Light each of the candles and let them burn for at least five minutes. From this point, you can no longer abort the ritual. After the five minutes have passed, burn the tuft of hair on one of the candles. Proceed to blow out all the candles one by one. When the last candle is put out, quickly close your eyes and count to 100. Open your eyes. To remember, you must always close the door behind you. Leaving it open may attract unwanted attention. Do not let the rune out of your possession. It is your only protection. Do not bring any weapons with you. If you arm yourself, so th will they. Should anything be heard or felt while you count to 100, it must be ignored. Do not open your eyes. Do not turn on the lights. Do not move. It is normal to feel like you are not alone. You won't be. Is that the ritual we're doing now? Yeah. I wonder if anyone else has tried it. Probably not. It was sealed when I got it. 
That's weird. Did they think it was cursed? Maybe. I should probably glue it back later. Okay, so can we leave? Can we leave now? Ah. Uh, but I haven't even l lit the candles yet. Wait a moment. This doesn't look right. We should have come across stairs a while back. That's true. Maybe we took a wrong turn somewhere? Let's just keep going. We're back here? Maybe this is the school's way of saying you can't leave now. H how can you just say something like that? Are we going home soon? I don't think we can go home anymore. Oh shit! Ugh. Let's try opening this. Oh no, we, we didn't get the hair clip yet. Can we still get the hair clip? Yep, we can. <laughs> Alright, let's try opening that door. Uh, so I, I did everything in the room. And then I noticed that this wasn't a wall anymore. Th that's weird. What is the existence of this room? It makes no sense. W what do you mean? Based on the shape of the school, there can't be a room here. It would be floating in the air when seen from the outside. Interesting. But we didn't even finish the ritual. What's happening? I don't know. Isn't it exciting? Let's keep going. Sealed shot. Can we still use the same key? The locker has no keyhole. Cleaning products. Cleaning cart. Sparkling clean. There's... A calendar with no dates. <gasps> this must be like a year's supply of chalk. They're packed too tightly, I can't pull any out. A lamp, there's no bulb. Some box filled with shoes and lighters. Large locker, it's sealed shut. So, maybe the ritual worked? But the ritual wasn't finished. Which means either the school has a bunch of cursed looking rooms and a dark secret, or this isn't the school anymore. If it's not the school, then what it is it? No idea. In any case, it doesn't feel too dangerous, so let's continue. Large locker, it's locked. Blue cans. Pile of boxes, stuck together. Why? <laughs> why are why are the trash cans like that? I'm guessing these are all locked. Yeah. This room feels different. I, is it safe? Ah, oh, there you are. Wait, I don't think this is the demon. Who are you? What is this place? Straight to the point, I see. Well, this isn't quite your world. What? Let's not get into it. You're doing a ritual, correct? Stop and go home. All of you. I mean it. Excuse me? Cat, if you keep doing what you're doing, things won't end well. Do you know this person, Cat? Not at all. They seem to know you, though. What is it with everyone warning me lately? I need some answers. So far- Stop! Don't cross that line. <sighs> if you haven't realized by now, the ritual works. It will take you somewhere you'll never return from. If it works, then I should definitely finish it. Cat, what are you saying? Sorry, but I can't listen to this person. I have my reasons for doing this. I don't know how much you value what you have right now, but... If you continue down this path, you lose everything. Everything you hold dear, and everything you don't. Your questions will not receive any satisfying answers, and everything you know about the world will turn meaningless. Those three. Are you willing to sacrifice their lives for your so-called reasons? Lives? Furthermore, your own life. 
Are you willing to die for the answers you're seeking? Let's go back, cat. I want to leave. I don't believe you. Why don't you just give me my answers yourself then? Spare me the trip. I thought so. I've said what I needed to. Why? Who are you? Just someone who has seen too many humans die. It would sadden me to add you four to the pile. Go home, cat. Can't you feel it in the air here? You're all in danger. Cat, please. This feels too dangerous. Cat, let's just go. Yeah, let's get out of here. I didn't sign up for this. Cat, we don't want something bad to happen to you. Fine, let's go. Are you by any chance the same person from my dream earlier today? The dream? It must have been your subconscious warning you as well. I see. I'll pass on the ritual for tonight. That's good enough. And so we left the school and walked home. No one said anything for a while. I think Cat is feeling down. Yeah. Should we do something? What's on your mind? I don't know. You think Cat likes to sing? Hmm. Good idea, Saki. I haven't you seen I haven't seen you this excited about karaoke before, Kaya. That's a yes then. All right. So, we were thinking of going to this place. I can't do this. She's ignoring me. Cat. Hmm. Come with us. Huh? Just come. Sure, whatever. You're so good. Are they trying to cheer me up? Maybe things are better this way. I need to believe that much at least. Dead End K7. Girls Night Out. Alright. So I was... I did a bit of research after I got that ending. The, the one where they all go home. There's a couple of more endings, like variations of how you die, and if you take the the friends on the ritual and how that turns out. But basically, those are all the major endings after doing some research. So that, that was a fun game. Uh, I like the premise. Very old schooly RPG maker horror game, but very polished because the animations were pretty good, honestly, and the music was top notch. So. I'm looking forward to the full release. I am definitely playing Chapter 1 when it comes out. So, thank you for watching me play Project Cat Paper Lily Prologue. Um, the next game I'm playing on this uh, track, on the RPG Maker Horror track, is a an old French indie horror game named Off. Of course, it has... Um, English uh, translation, so I won't be reading French. I can't speak French. But yeah, I'll be playing off on the suggestion of one of my viewers. Uh, that game I've watched, but just like this one, it's been so long ago that I completely forgot how it goes anyway. So that's also basically a blind playthrough for me. So if you want to see that and other indie horror games, maybe leave a like and subscribe. This has been Caffeinified Gaming. And I'll see you guys in the next series.